hello guys welcome back to the dusty brand i'm so excited because i will be giving a review on different types of corsets like okay in this video i have 16 different type of corsets so i'll be giving details on each of the corsets and the styles i'll be telling you how it fits and how to rock the styles so i want you to sit tight and watch this video to the end a lot of us don't know that corset has different types yes corset has different types so i brought out 16 different types of corset to show to you guys and give you a little details on how the corset looks and please don't forget to subscribe to this channel like our videos your best will be blog at the dusty brand guys there are various kind of corset styles the popularly known corset is the cup corset just a few people know about um, the victoria corsets whereas there are over 16 kind of corset that we have are you surprised we don't have to be surprised so guys i'll be giving a review on the 16 types of corset corsets that we have and i'll be listing them out then i'll start giving you details on each of them and also show you a sample of it alongside so on my list here i have um the hourglass corset we have the pipe steam corset the wraps corset the 4s cup corset we have the ribbon corset the corsetlet corset we have the victoria corset we have the corset belt we have the Edwardian corsets. We also have um, the front and back lace corsets, the Elizabethan corsets, the appearing corset, overboss corset, underboss corset, the mid boss corset, the waspy corset, and definitely we have our cup corset. So, guys, stay tuned as I give you details on each of the corsets and how they look like. And the reason why they are being styled the way they are and how you are going to rock those different type of corsets this is the hourglass corset among the most classic or traditional corset type the hourglass gives you a small waist by snatching it instead of compressing your ribs this particular corset won't compress your hips and your upper body hence it offers um, a superior comfort flexible fit and easy to wear the hourglass curve corset can have a sweetheart shape or a straight neckline and a mid boss under boss or over boss length so this is um, a little details about the hourglass our number two is the pipe steam corset the pipe steam corset has a rigid boning that will compress your torso making it look longer than usual if you can see very well this particular corset is long and it has a lot of boning however it's also the reason the corset puts a severe strain on your lower ribs Experts suggest regular waist training to ensure you fit into the pipe steam corset. Also, you must not wear this type of corset for extended period to prevent back pain. Our number 3 corset is the WAFS corset as its name suggests. This corset will make your body look like a wrap segmented body because it gives you a super tiny waist. The problem is that it squeezes your waist too tight, straining your abdomen and ribs, rib cage. Like it has to squeeze your waist region so tight so you get a particular fitting. This is all about a wrap corset.
Our fourth corset is the ribbon corset and this is one of the trending corset styles that a lot of fashion designers will create and the ribbon corset is made of lightweight fabric or fabric strip. You can wear it daily and won't feel that tight, too tight thing. That is one thing about this ribbon corset. It's one of the trending and easy going kind of corset. Our uh, number five is the corset belt. And this corset belt is also known as the waist nature. It's very comfortable, it's very reliable and you can wear this for um, at least 24 hours or for a very long time as long as you are comfortable on it. And it comes in different types, in different form. It's so easy to wear, simple and beautiful. So this is the corset belt, easy to wear and comfortable. This is our number 6 corset and it's known as the Victoria corset, popular in the mid 90s. Victoria corsets are somewhat less comfortable than the Elizabethan corset. It has an overbust corset that skews your ribs to reduce your waist size, giving you the classic hourglass shape. It also has a curved bust line pointed or sweetheart neckline and pointed bottom. Number 7 is the Edwardian corset. This type of corset were popular in the early 20th century, from 1990 to thereabouts. They extend below your hips and push your, your hips backward and your chest outward, giving you a S shape body curve and it's so beautiful the edwardian design it's popular it's trending and a lot of people create this particular design This is our number 8 type of corset and is known as the front and back lace corset. You can also call it the lace corset and this particular kind of corset is available in three different types depending on where the lacing starts from. You can find front to lace, front and back lace and triple lace that is lacing in front, back and inside so this particular corset has different lacing pattern okay so before we continue with the remaining types of corset yes I've given eight types I told you we have 16 types of corset so I've given eight types before we go further I want to so you guys um, on the fabric you can use for corset not all fabric suits a corset design and there are some fabric you need to use that brings out the beauty of a corset style or rather a corset design so I just want to throw more light to some fabric I think you can use to create a corset design that will make it look so beautiful and attractive and easy to sew because there are some fabric that can be very stressful most times so i i want to give you some fabric that you can actually use in creating your corset size when i'm done with that then i'll give you guys the remaining types of corset we have okay i have the brocade this material is perfect if you want a eye caching type of corset that excludes class and elegance. So there are some um, fabric that can actually bring out the, the style, the, the boldness and elegancy in that particular creativity. But this brocade is a very nice material if only you want 
an eye-catching type of corset, then you can use the brocade fabric. Then I have the cotton. The cotton is the best material for corset that you prefer to wear under your clothes or when you live in a humid area because of its great ability. So the cotton is a very nice fabric you can as well try when creating a corset style. It's one of the best anyway. You can try it out and it brings out the best. Okay, we have the lace fabric. Everybody uses um, the lace fabric. Similar to cotton, yeah, there are some lace fabric that are similar to, to cotton. Lace is breathable but will give you a sexier feeling. You can also wear it under a thin or see-through clothes since it isn't as thick as cotton. The lace is comfortable, beautiful and it brings out a lot of creativity especially when it's been made by um, a very good fashion designer. Next on our list is the PVC and it's probably the sexiest corset material. Note, PVC will contain your body well as long as you perfectly wear it and keep it in mind that like leather, PVC corsets are best worn over your clothes and they are so beautiful and thick. Okay, we also have the satin fabric. This luxurious, smooth and sharpening material makes the corset look luxurious. Just make sure your fabric is thick and has a medium of weight and give it a try on creating a corset style. It looks so beautiful. We also have the leather fabric. As a thick material, leather corsets are worn over your clothes and also the mesh fabric. It's like a lace. The mesh is breathable, lightweight and thin making. It's perfect for summer and hot weather as well as for the tiny or see-through clothing. It's a very tiny see-through clothing so it can be worn for during summer period, hot weather, etc. So these are the different kind of fabric you can use in creating a corset style. And our anchor fabric is not left behind. One of the best fabric you can use in creating anything, like anything, it goes well for different creativity, especially the Ankara print, and it's not left behind. You can as well use the Ankara fabric to create um, a corset design, and it is very comfortable and reliable. So, guys. I want you all to try out this beautiful fabric. I want to, you to know the know that there are some fabric that are very important while making a corset style. So when you are creating it, you know that you should be expecting something beautiful and something bigger. Guys, do all to subscribe to our channel, like our video, and thank you for your patience. Thank you for watching. Um, I'll continue with the remaining types of corset i was giving review on i just wanted you guys to see different corset styles different designs of corset and the fabric that was used in creating these beautiful corset styles and a lot of fabric was um, the lace fabric so you can as well make a very good choice in your fabric creativity and i'm sure you're going to, it's going to come out well so let's go back to uh, types of corsets there are many eight types of corsets i'm going to explain to you and give you a little details on each of the corset styles thank you for watching please don't stop watching continue watching like and subscribe to our youtube channel okay our number nine corset is the ropery corset this particular corset is yet another Christian Dior creation that has been popular since the 1940s. Well, it combined three different garments, a bustier, a waist snatcher, and a garter belt. And most of this particular design are in net fabric. This is the overboss corset. 
the overboss type corset has a length that starts under your arms and ends just above your hips. This design helps lift your breasts, reduce your waist size and support your back. Most women wear this particular type of corset as an outer wear but you can also wear them as it's paired with your favorite skinny jean or under your dress. Yes, this is one of my favorite type of corset, the underboss corset. This corset starts right below your breast and can be worn two ways. One is as a fashion accessory, that is by wearing it on top of the clothes. Another is underneath your clothes to support your back or minimize waistline size. Either ways, you would need to wear a bra since the corset won't support your breast. So this particular corset is the underboss corset. You will have to put on a bra to support it and it's so comfortable and beautiful. Next on our list is the waspy corset. This corset um, is popularized by Christian Dior. The waspy is shorter than the underboss corset but a little longer than the snitcher. Its length is from under your ribs to above your hips. The back has a lacing and elastic panel, allowing it to stretch from a more comfortable fit. The waspy is the perfect waist trainer that you can wear under your blouse and shirt or over your dress, dresses or skirt. So guys, this is an example of the waspy corset. We also have the mid boss corset. It begins at the middle of your boss and it ends right below your hips. This corset will give you a long and smooth body. You might worry about it preventing you from sitting comfortably, but designers ensure that the corset's boning stops a little higher than the OI tens of its length. Additionally, mid boss corsets will support your breasts, but it won't push them up. It only supports the breast. It doesn't push them up. And this um, is a design of the mid boss corset. The mid boss corset is also similar to the under boss corset, only that the under boss corset is able to push your boss up, but the mid boss corset doesn't push. The boss up that's a typical example of the mid boss corset and the under boss corset next on our list is the corselet corset this particular corselet covers your entire breast and extends to your hip so it helps gives your hip some shape to reduce your waist size and lift your breast it's a total cover of the boss it's very comfortable and can be worn under your clothes Okay guys, this is the cup corset, the popular corset we all know about. This particular corset is what is trending, a lot of people feel so comfortable on it and it's um, a kind of corset that covers the boss, it has a length from the boss down to the hip side, it has different design, different creativity, different shape. This particular cup corset can be used to create the Victoria corset, can be used in creating the Edwardian corset, the Elizabethan corset, like it comes out in different shape 
the difference is just that it has a cup and the cup covers the boss but from the waist to down to the hip it has different it has different shape and different beauty that comes out from the particular cup corset so guys these are the different kind of corsets the 16 different kind of corset i have to show you all i hope you enjoyed the video so guys i will love to show you different creativity that a lot of fashion designer has created from this corset design like a lot of beauty has come out from this particular corset styles the 16 type of corset i actually showed you guys you are going to see them in ankara fabric in lace fabric in the brocade fabric the leather fabric different kind of creativity different kind of corset styles i showed and different type of corset you are going to be seeing the different type of corset so i want you to sit back and pick out a beautiful style you will want to create just take a screenshot of it save it and send down to your fashion designer with a comfortable fabric and i tell you you're not going to regret the recreation because corset styles they are so beautiful guys stay tuned for more videos and pictures.